The book is basically um, it gets into his personal life. It basically is about the bond and the relationship my dad and I had. That was the main goal I wrote the book. That was basically my tribute to my father, the way of saying goodbye, but there's more to it than that. Um, that gets into his, I had a lot of stories that he told me when he was a young boy, things he did, he was a really mis mischievous kid. And he had an incredible arm, he could throw, he could throw a ball like a, like a rifle. And he did a lot of things with that to get himself, not to get in trouble, to stay out of trouble. He'd throw apples over, over houses, you know, to, to areas that there's no way they could fathom that, that apple was coming from his yard. And his friends would be over there halfway down the block telling him, throw it lower, throw it higher, and he'd be throwing them into people's parties and raise all kinds of havoc in a crazy Italian neighborhood that, back in Brooklyn. That, there was always an Italian guy on the block that was crazy, and he'd get them all stirred up and things like that. He'd, so between those stories and the progression as I was, I was born and things he taught me and things we did together, a lot of unseen art from what, back in the 50s and 60s. So I used to be a little boy and I'd hear the phone ring all the time. And it was the publisher and he'd be, yeah, yeah, it's done. I just have to put my name on it. Oh yeah, it just has to dry. He didn't even start it. And it was due like two days ago and the publishers are dying because it has to go to press for the book. And he'd sit there and uh, tap me on the top of my head. I was about four years old and say, I said, Dad, how are you going to finish it? He goes, don't worry, you go to bed, it'll be done. And I get up in the morning and it was done. He'd be sitting there, we'd sip in his cup of coffee. And uh, it was finished, and I say, wow. He goes, what do you think? I said, well, that's good, Pop. It's good, Pop. He tapped me on top of the head again, and he'd drink more coffee, and then he put it in the oven to dry with a, with a big oven, uh, put, put the gas on, and the, he'd pull the painting out, and the painting would sit there and warp and like a sea. And I'm sitting there with my eyes ready to bug out of my head. Uh-oh, Dad, what are you going to do? And he'd sit there calmly, no, no, no stress, and just take it out, walk over to the sink, wipe the bottom of it with a wet rag, and then we just form back to this flat shape. It's like, that's in the book too. I think that's in the book somewhere. But there's just so many things. It'll be the Facebook fan page. Anything I hear, it'll be out as soon as I get the go-ahead for it. I mean, I, I like to keep everybody as updated as I possibly can. So it'll be there to look for it.